Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're doing quarter two savings update, update on budget in July and all the rest good things. So without further ado, uh, let's go. So I am once again telling you that I'm pre-filming these videos before I leave on my world trip and I'm going to be back in August only. So I'm kind of skipping July this year. I do have July's budget sheets prepared. So for July, I picked the salmon pink color and the quote of the summer looks out from her brazen tower through the flashing bars of July. And I wanted to set up the calendar, but I realized it doesn't make really sense because I won't have any budget uh, setups. So it would be only like me being travel wise. Um, so yeah, I decided not to do it because I am still a budgeting channel. So I was like, why would I set up a calendar that has nothing to do with budgeting? But yes, I decided to just film this video to update the quarter savings because I realized June is the end of quarter two and I didn't film this video and I was just like, oh my god, I do have to update my savings and this is all over the place, you know, this video kind of in between the video that I didn't know when to post or when to film. So it's just kind of, this is an update on what the July situation is and also updating uh, the savings also i don't want to introduce august yet because i will be back in like beginning of august and i think i'll film all of the videos then i also don't know about like what my income holds or what will happen so yes without further talking we can just count the um, savings uh if you do want a july setup video just let me know i'll probably won't film it because i will see it only <laughs> in uh when i'm on holiday but if i see comments saying that you want to see like my layout for july i will probably just tell you in a video like where we are going but we are fr flying first to greece then to singapore then to indonesia and then to malaysia and then to istanbul uh, in turkey and then to paris so that's kind of the layout for the month of traveling so yeah <laughs> okay this makes no sense i'm so sorry i've been filming like five videos in a row it's 35 degrees celsius here and my room doesn't have air conditioning so i'm all over the place i'm very hot and i'm stressed because i'm leaving tomorrow and i don't know what's happening that's why i'm rambling and that's why everything is that is but yes see this is my quarter savings layout i put on uh, the budget beginning of year uh, balance when we started the year and this is for quarter one so the total was 9,431 the change from the beginning of year was a positive 4,114 euro difference and then we have four kind of categories short-term saving funds uh not saving funds, sinking funds, long-term sinking funds, savings, and miscellaneous. And here I just wrote, I rewatched my previous video to know which categories I included where and which I didn't. So I just wrote it down with an erasable pen and I will just um, erase it when I don't need it anymore. So today we're filling in the quarter two and I plan on maybe putting, let's see, do I have my purple marker? No, I lost my purple marker. Okay, I'll just use a, I'll use a pink one and I will put down uh, the change. So I want to put down the change from beginning of the year. And then I want to put down the change of quarter two minus uh, the f first quarter total. So I want to see both of those differences. So let's use pink today and let's start with our short term sinking funds. And we are not including rollover in this category because I, as I explained in my first video, rollover is kind of a place where I accumulate money that I'm going to later put into my cash envelope. So I don't really count it as savings. So it's just rollover money. Um, I hope it makes sense. If it doesn't, just bear with me. That's my logic. But yes, let's start. So clothing has 50 and next health has 50, 100, 50, 200, 50, 300, 310, 320, 325 plus, okay, beauty, what we have in beauty is 10 in nails, laser has 50, 60, Pillows, hair has nothing, facials has five, and products has 20, 21, 22, 23, and 24. 
Okay. So that's in beauty. Okay, next is travel and travel has 5100, 50, 200, 50, 300, 350, 400, 450, 470, 480, 490, 495, 496, 497, 497. Okay, and then we have gifts. And gift has 50, 100, 110, and 115. So we already hit the 1,000 mark, which is great. And we are not counting rollover, as I said. And fun has 20, 45. Okay, so the total in short term sinking funds for quarter two is 1,131. So let's write it down 1,131. So the change from quarter one is a positive 257 euro change great next is a long-term sinking funds so that's my daisy binder and first is car and car has 50 75 and 76 plus we have house next and it has 50 75 and 76 okay next is retirement and retirement has 50 100 50 200 25 210 okay stocks have 50 70 80 85 86 Okay, bets is next and it has 50, 75, and 76. And then technology is next. It has one, two, three, four, and five. And then we have weddings. Weddings has 50, 75, and 76. Plus fifty, seventy, five, and seventy six in babies. So the total for quarter two in long term saving fund, saving fund, sinking fund is six hundred eighty one, and the change from quarter one is a negative four hundred and seventy nine euro change uh, because I did pay for my phone uh, over a thousand and three hundred euros so I'm not even surprised that this went down next is a uh, miscellaneous and first is Christmas in miscellaneous and we have 100 in my sisters we have 100 in my mom's 100 in my dad's plus 50 60 65 and 70 in no uh, friends so that's 370 in christmas then we have 20 40 45 50 51 in etsy we have charity with 21 and then last category in miscellaneous is Tattoos and piercings, and it has 20, 30, 35, 36, and 37. So in total, it's 479. So let's write it down. Miscellaneous is 479, and it's a positive change of 369 euros. Great. Because uh, at that point, when we started quarter one, uh, all of the envelopes in the miscellaneous category were new envelopes, so they didn't have a starting balance. So I don't, uh, I'm not surprised that it went up by so much because we just managed to stuff more in the other three months uh, after the savings, uh, after quarter one. Okay, and last is savings, and it has four categories. So first is Monday up to Friday, and it has. 
50, 100, 150, 150, 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. So 155 plus. What next is 30 for 30. And here we have 250, 70, 90, 300, 35, 36, 37, 38, 39, and 310. So 310 and 30 for 30. Then is rainy day, which is my emergency fund. We have 1,200, 250, 300, 350, 400, 450, 460. So 1,460. And plus what we have in world trip. So I also, in this video, I wanted to update my financial goals of this year. But I re when I looked at the list, I realized that we haven't had any updates. We haven't hit new goals from the first uh, last time I filmed an update. So I just didn't want to do a useless kind of mention. So yeah, next is world trip. And what we have in world trip is, let's check flights. We have 1,500, 650, and 60. So 1,660 in flights. Then in hotels, we have 2,155 and eight. So 2,158 plus what we have in fees which is 110, 15, 16. So 116 plus food, we have 1,500, 700, 840. So 1,840 plus spending, we have 555 plus miscellaneous, which has 550, 70, 80, uh, 95, 6. So 596. So in total, in the savings category, let me just put everything back so we don't lose anything. Okay, so in total, we have 8,850 euros, which is a change from quarter one of uh, a positive 1,563 euros. So I... Uh, They'd expect it to be a bit higher, but then I, uh, then again, I already spent like 4,000 of this money uh, for my US trip. So I'm still uh, glad that it's positive, even though it's positive by only a thousand uh, and a half, thousand and a half euros. Is that correct? <laughs> 1,500 euros. Okay, so let's calculate the total and see the changes, which is the most exciting part. So 1,131 plus 681 plus 479 plus 8,850. So the total for across all of my sinking fund savings and miscellaneous for quarter two is 11,141 euros. Yay! And as we can see, it is a positive change. So let's see first uh, the change from the previous uh, quarter. So we are divide, uh, subtracting um, 9, so 11,141 minus 9,431. And it's a positive change of 1,710 euros. But the positive change from the beginning of the month is not beginning of the month, beginning of the year, 5,317. And the positive change is almost 6,000 euros. So plus 5,824 euros. Insane. So we managed to save up for three months more than uh, uh, 1,500 euros. And the, not looking at the fact that we spent over 4,000 euros on my US trip, we spent money in all of my categories. We still made progress and it's good. And it's well, and this is what I want to see. We will see at the end of um, August, of September, of September uh, quarter three, and we will see the changes there. And then at the end of December, we will fill in quarter four and then fill in the total changes for the year. And I'm very excited for this. And I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, please give it a like and consider subscribing to my channel. We have fun over here. I'm once again, sorry that it was so chaotic, but hopefully you understood at least something. But yeah, in the meanwhile, what did I want to say in the meanwhile? No, I forgot my own outro. How dare I? But yes, I wish you a very wonderful day and I hope to see you next time. Bye.